All right, everyone, and welcome aboard. I'll be your Captain Hillian uh, today, along with... Who's Midrick here at your service? And welcome back to Valheim, where... Actually, is this the second stream or is this the third one? I kind of uh, blanked on that. Yep. Right. <laughs> I named it wrong then. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll have to change that. Give me a quick second. Uh, it is still a small thing, though, and thank you for the sausages as I look away and the stew. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, last time, uh, we got some metal work done. We got, well, between streams, be well, between the first and second stream, I managed to get enough uh, of these set up so that we can actually repair our advanced gear. Uh, Drakir has also been working with the food... <laughs> and brought over a bunch of seeds for onions. And, uh, well, the turnips were already brought over last time. Yeah, I had a bit of a situation where I had almost too much food from attacking wolf events a lot at. And yeah, here yeah. I had shortage some food, so put one and one together. Yeah, like, <laughs> we have made way too many sausages now, and he has even more on his own server, or his own world. Yeah, that's basically half I brought over. I love it, but also some extra intestines over. Okay, let me make a quick little chest for the seeds. I'll put that down over here, and yes, I, I killed a troll and hung its head up. <laughs> it was actually just before stream. I was, I was digging out uh, a big-ass copper d deposit. And uh, there... And yeah, it snuck up on me. It it almost killed me, yeah, because I I wasn't fed up. Uh, well, fed up. I wasn't. Uh, I didn't have enough uh, strong enough bleh, strong enough food boosts and such. Uh, but I still managed to kill it, and now its head is hanging up there permanently. Uh, uh, wait, wait, wait! Uh, come back! Come back! Come back! Okay, oh, how wolf do meat. I, how do I keep hitting your face? <laughs> <laughs> because you're trying to force feed me these. <laughs> I guess it will work. Okay, can't we can't sleep at the moment, so I'm guessing it's morning or becoming morning. Yeah, put Oop. some of the extra food over here. Okay. Says, yeah, last time I realized the food we had. I like, yes, we have good armor, but. The health we had in Stemma was so low that it didn't really help too much. Yeah. Uh, not that it put us in much danger in the area that we are now, but in other areas, uh, yeah, that would be a problem. Yeah. And trolls... Even in this area, the trolls would be a problem with the bad food. Now we have a... Well, better chance. Okay. Is this... This is more mid-game food, I guess you could say. No, we can make better wolf recipes, just we don't have the upgrade in kitchen for it. So we can only cook r cook regular wolf meat, but that will do f for the moment. Yeah, and what we're going to be doing for the moment is first off we're headed back to the merchant and getting our boat. <laughs> and then yeah, we're going to the explore him. <clears throat> we also going to grab that iron. Uh, let's see. For a portal, it was 20 fine wood, 10 eyes, and 2 cores. We don't have enough for 2, but we can just make... <clears throat> we can just make a... Or rename the portal here to something else. And then we'll make a, a different portal somewhere. And so that we can easily return. Yeah, so let's make a portal here so it's ready. So we don't just plot the portal and realize, oh... We forgot the first portal. <laughs> yeah, I, I just said we don't have enough for two portals. So we, we need more fine wood for that, 30 to be exact, to make two, that is. But that should be relatively easily. There should be some more fine wood about. Yeah, I've got all the fine wood we have at the moment, which is 10. So, yeah, I'll, I'll just look for some burst trees. We should have some seeds of those. We should probably plant those out here. Yeah, actually, this could... Well, this is, will not be our main base, but this could be a good uh, logging camp? 
Yeah. Also, apparently the deer don't give a crap about me today. So yeah, we'll start off with a bit of heart, with a bit of uh, logging. Then we'll go grab the boats and start sailing and get off yeah, this I... island. Yeah, I will help. Since yeah, two is better than one. Two strawberries. And yeah, mm. I talked to Hilly and I, I realized if we are better off making a. B Oops, I destroyed a berry bush. Uh, better, better off making a base in Black Forest or Meadows. For I realized. Uh, some hours ago that planes and plane base might be risky for once we enter the mislands misland event can start and misland events like if misland raids that have been mislands and the planes yeah and apparently there's one <laughs> raid of those that we really do not want yeah they did y'all flying Balloons to shoot fires and bomb with ticks. <laughs> okay. And uh, let's see. I have 28. Basically, you need uh, black marble structures to able handle the fire. For they will, they will destroy wood easily and stone easily. Very misty. <laughs> you almost think these are the mist lands. Luckily um, not. Yeah. How much do? How much fine wood do you have? Oh, uh, let's see. Twelve. Okay, that means we have enough. Oh, it's good to grab some extra, just in case. Yeah, That's also grabbing some berries. Oop, here's another. Yeah, I will not be surprised if we're going to need the berries for decorations and some yam. And also, I hope we're able to find a better base location that we can start Farming for real, like a proper carrot and turnip and onion farm. Yeah, because those farms can get pretty big depending on how many seeds you have. Yeah, and since we are two players, like if you're only one player, you don't necessarily need a very big farm technically, but two players, yeah, you're gonna need a proper one. Yeah, and even, and, even more on a server. Yeah. At least on the server, they get time to grow. Here we... Uh, here's the issue is we don't know whenever we can play this. Off stream yeah. or on stream. So, with luck, I think we might be able to do it a bit a bit more often. If we're lucky. But still. <laughs> as long as we're just on a roll. Going for half a kilometer or something. <laughs> okay, 35. Oh, and skeletons. Where did those come I from? Might be a rune or something nearby. And I got uh, 23 fine wood now. Okay, we have more than enough for the moment, so let's head back. Just gonna take down this one, and as you realized, I have no I haven't eaten a single stamina fruit yet. No wonder my stamina is low. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> Eighteen and fifty-five. Now, let's see. Was this the boar stone or something else? Um. Oh no, this of great dwarfs. I'll there just go. grab oh, this one. <laughs> okay. I'll go patch that hole in the fence, <laughs> and then. Uh, we can take off. Yeah, probably going to yeah put a door on it. Uh, uh, let's go. see. Or dandelions. There. One thing that is somewhat annoys me is that how the wood gates cost twelve woods, but the normal one costs four, even though it's like only fifty percent bigger. Yeah, though they are, I guess I hope they have more health since they're described as gates. So it's, I hopefully, I hope it's a, a bit of a, to do with health. Maybe. It looks a little bit off, but okay. Yeah, It'll keep uh, the door intact. I will put away the extra fine wood. Okay. Spin this thing around to face the correct way, and there. 
dandelions in here. And then we'll call this one floor. Okay. Let me go dump the rest of the stuff. So we have some free inventory space. Uh, feathers. Trophy. Once we have a good pair of trof a good amount of trophies, we should probably go hang those up everywhere. I'd not be opposed to that. So we take some resin with me. In case we need to do something. Throw that away. I'll take a stack of wood so we can build up a little camp. Yeah, I have a stack of wood with me as well. And some six stones. We can make a campfire and three great dwarf in case we need it. Okay. Uh, full on bones. Store that yeah. there for a second. As it is, I'm looking forward to a new base where I can make a nicer house. We probably will start with a small house just for cooking and sleeping. But the uh, more cooking we need, the bigger house we need, and I will increase it. This here is more of a good starting house for multiple people. For, yeah, I think I said it before, just for as a workshop, kitchen, a sleeping area. Yeah, the guy that we raided previously, or last time, uh, yeah, they had a really, really big long house. They did? Yep. Like, uh, probably a 50% wider than this or something. Yeah. And, nope. yeah, even longer. Yeah, like, you can make very big houses early on, but then you have the problem of stability. Like, that's why I like core wood for it's... If you can get core wood early on, it will help you decently with house building. And I have also done experimentations that I can make a actually effective chimney. Okay, I think we have all that we need. So let's go. <coughs> what the heck? It's well, it's no heavily outside now. <laughs> okay. Oops. I would take that as a good omen. I almost blew into a wall. Might need to expand the wall a bit there. Uh, we depend on how often we get here. Let's see, I'm grabbing the iron now. Says, I feel we will want that iron with us. Uh, let's see. What do you do with the hoe? Oh. Wait, should you do that in our main base? Yeah, probably, but I forgot to put them down there. I don't want to go back again. Oh dear. Okay, where's that boat? There it is. Oh, there's some team here. Uh, mm, I just remember that. I look forward to where we have a better boat. For this one has only four slots. Yeah. But we're going to need iron for that in quite a bit. Yeah, so. we have four, but that iron we have here is for stone cutting. Do I want to. Should I grab some uh, tin? Uh. Yeah, we can always grab some along the way uh, when next when we're off screen. Also, let me do this quick. Come on. There. Oh and yeah, then this. A, yeah, you need to repair. Good point. A good idea. Yeah, always a also, good idea to repair your boat before you take off. Yeah, and actually, whenever you walk past your boat, such don't quickly double check if it needs repairs. Yeah, because mobs will go after it. Yeah, mobs or, if you're lucky, waves can make it bump into a rock or something. Yeah. I started okay. to, in some cases, put torches near my boat, especially on the water stones, to discourage some mobs from going near it. Like, necks are afraid of fire, like the graylings. Same with boars. And fun fact, on one of our earlier maps, Abor destroyed our longship. Yeah. One single boar. And he, he didn't believe it, it first. What? 
Yeah, the stupid thing gets stuck with it, I think. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Um, I'll try to focus on just getting us around. Can you keep an eye out for land across the water? Uh, land straight ahead. And a little tower that just spawned in. Yeah. <laughs> Oops, someone else is playing Valheim. Oh yeah, I saw that. It's. I am forcing now, war. I always keep I always keep forgetting to turn do not disturb on. I okay. never do that, but I never have a problem with it. Then again, <coughs> I'm a cool commentator, not a streamer. Yeah. Oh. Wait, will I count as a stream at the moment? Uh technically. Alright, then I oh. sort of streamer but he's the one doing the filming, so to speak. Yeah. And I'm doing the advisory. Let's see. If we brought our fi if we brought the fishing rod, we probably could catch some fish. There are some recipes with those, but I don't think I've ever made any of those. And the wind I turns. Have. The fish meat is okay, but the food made of them is better. Yeah, of course. And we can still. F uh, that you implement you can pick them up on the beaches again and they sometimes jump up on the boat. <laughs> I actually say that a big troll fish jumped onto my boat. Right next to me. I just looked at him and I just got off my seat, put him in my bag. <clears throat> uh, I've, ac I've actually had something similar happen in real life. Uh, during a vacation to... Uh, I actually don't have no clue what to... Okay, what's with the shuddering? Uh, during a vacation to... What used to be Czechoslovakia, I think? Uh, there... Yeah, we had a... We had a vacation with a... Well, a vacation home somewhere out in the woods and such. And yeah, what is up with the shuddering? Um, no yeah, and... <laughs> There was a little lake nearby. And yeah, we had an inflatable boat that we would take on to that. And uh, during one of those times that we did that, for some reason, the stupid fish started jumping up against it and a few actually jumped into it. They were thrown oh. back, of course. <laughs> okay. That's a little bit interesting fish behavior. And um, yeah, here's another thing here, people. While boats are the f a faster way of transportation, wind may not always be your friend, and sometimes will outright just bully you. Yeah, like it, is, like it is expressly going against us right now. Yeah, like you think, okay, now I can turn around to a new direction. And it suddenly makes a big flip against you. Yeah, I think it changes like every five minutes or so. Uh, can confirm, and I see so there's a, a, a different island straight ahead of us. Uh, yeah, that's not part of the one we are on. Yeah, and, and it has a mountain. Yeah, we've had it before that it seems to have a mountain. And over to our left is the Draugr village, where I died a good few times, if you can see the death markers as well. Uh, actually, no. Okay. I see the nodes, but no death markers. <coughs> but I guess it is. That, that, that could have been a... Actually, that could be a... Okay, uh... Base location, if needed. Yeah. Since it, it is close to water. And if there if that is a swamp on the other side, it'll make a good... Yeah, a good outpost to cross over from. Ooh, and I can see a, a Draugr waddling around over there. Yeah, so a lot of items glittering over there for a moment. Ooh, something tried to shoot at us. But no, something died in the water. Yeah, they, they are attacking the ant and wildlife. What is with this? There's I... a fish next to you. Oh. <laughs> 
history repeats itself in a game. <laughs> yeah. I, I didn't even notice a thing getting in. No, did I? I just noticed it when I turned around. I saw it uh, lagging <laughs> out between your thighs, so next to your thigh on the board. Uh. Nope. That one almost oh, joined it. Well, <laughs> snack for along the way. Oh dear gods. Yeah, uh, as I said, uh, before I forget, something I noticed, I hope, is a true thing. Like, wherever you find bone mass, that you will probably find a lot of crypts. Yeah. So it makes me uh, wonder if we should kill the Elder, find bone mass, and maybe make a base somewhat near it. Uh, no, not in the spawn, but uh, maybe within the same island. Yeah. Or nearby island. I'm not entirely comfortable with going across the water like this on just the paddling. Uh, yeah. I agree. But it is close you. enough. Yeah, I prefer, would prefer to do this with a long boat. Still, the chance of serpent spawning at the moment is rather small, though the sun is going down. They only spawn in the ocean. They are still in meadows, actually. So. Yeah. This, might too, this might be too shallow. Yeah, I look straight down, and all I see is black. Still in meadows. And. By the light, I guess we will land here and make camp? Yeah, definitely going to put up a little hut. Uh, let's see, those look like dark forest uh, trees, and those look like meadows trees. And yeah, it actually does have mountains, it looks. That's just good for, if you want to upgrade, uh, have a better kitchen, we need a little bit of silver, like one or two for a butcher table, which would allow us to make uh, wolf meat and onion recipes. Okay, I mistook a tree for Odin there for a bit. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, here to the left between Wait. the rocks looks like a good spot. Alien! What? That's planes. Uh, to our left or right? Uh, where I am looking now, right past that those pine trees is planes, so... Okay. Let's, Let's park see. between the next two rocks, then. Yeah, that, that looks like a good uh, docking air. Are those playing trees as well? If it is, it's a little tiny bit. Still counts. I'm still reading as meadows. I think this is a area where some planes wanted to be created, but landed underwater. Okay, now it says planes. Oh, why was it crouched? But over there is meadows. So, but there is nothing here, luckily enough. So, hmm. Oh, yeah, this counts as planes. Um, but no mob. I guess this could be a candidate for a uh, farm. Yeah, I can see a great dwarf. <clears throat> okay, let's deal with you quick. Well, so far, um, Helian, look over there. Uh, oh, those <laughs> those spawned right behind us. We. There we will not make a farm here, but yeah. Oh, blood, we can't... Yes, we can kill them, maybe. The problem is, we can't cook them. Our cooking station is too small. I saw some... There's something fighting here. Oh, wait, that's a torch. Oh, it's surlings. No, no not or, surling. no, surlings. Yeah. Those are furlings. Yeah. Worse. Okay. okay, getting out of here then. Like we could take them uh -oh, as is. Ilian, you angered him. Uh, no, they're just curious. It seems. No, that's aggravation. Uh, rather. Okay. okay. That... Ow. Okay. 
I hit the boat instead. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Whose side are you on, anyways? Okay. Quick park. Quick repair. Ow. Ow. And then the water. Yep, damn it. Well, no, yep. I try to get them away. Okay, time for some of the bigger heat foods. There was a stamina, not a health one. Uh, okay. I you need to lure them somewhere else. Uh, let's see, we could go up the cliff. He's attacking the boat! The bastard thing is attacking the boat instead now. And there it breaks. Okay, we should still be able to salvage the parts. Ooh. Come on. Give me. Oh, yeah, that hurts. It lets me not be out in the water when I die, at least. Oh, this and is... This is one of the... We should not have landed here. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> if wait, those stupid you... things just hadn't spawned behind us. Yeah, we don't even have good arrows for this. Yeah, the prior ones also, would be best against I, him, I think. I I saw a swamp nearby. Uh, did you grab the boat parts? I think I have most of them. I, uh, okay, I don't see the nails. Okay, I will and, go see if I can grab the nails. And I think Ow. one of the goblins is nearby because I can hear them. Oh, that one isn't... He's just interested, not aggressive. Also, I keep getting a few of them from within the Lox's face. Oh, no. It broke near very deep water. I can't grab them. Okay. Uh, we'll just have to shake these two off. Oh, that's a Deskito. Uh, yeah, you can see why the planes are a bit of an issue. Yeah, we are not ready for it. I, we, yes, we, I gave a good armor, but... Not against those. Oh, I think the locks. Oh, are they chasing you? No, you. They're... Oh, there the you others are. have uh, abandoned us at the moment. They're just in panic. Just that one remaining at uh, aggressive. I regret saying this, but we need, we're gonna need to run through the swamp. Then we still have the stuff for the portal, so we aren't stranded. Luckily enough, but. Yeah. Copper nails are easier to replace than iron nails, at least. Or not copper, bronze. Uh, yeah, you need tin and copper. Okay, no longer being ham... <clears throat> Pardon? No longer being hampered by being soaked. And we and lost it. I think you lost more than just the spikes uh, into the water. I think I saw some uh, hide. The deer hide. Oh, yeah. That, hmm. I gave okay, me no stranded things to the portal, but... Yeah. Could have gone a lot worse. Yeah. Okay, so we... what is that green glow? Uh, guck. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah, that's to... on the tree here. Yeah, we use them for crafting the bow. You can also use a fire source, and there's a new new mob that drops it as well now. Okay. Uh, uh, let's make a little notice. outpost up here. Yeah, for we're not building. We don't. I don't want to be the two closer swamp in case Abe wanna say hello. You know, you will know Abe when you see him. Okay. It's. <laughs> you, basically, you will hear him. And see the screen shaking when you know he's there. Let's see, looking for a somewhat flat place here. Uh, 
And we'll probably just have to make a little hut and just clear out a bunch of trees. And I think I heard a boar. Yeah, it was off me. I just realized we could make a pit house. And that be? Yep. Uh, a bit of a dent in the ground with the roof. Anyway, I thought I was equipping the hammer, not unequipping it. Uh, Alright, here's yeah. a somewhat open area. Yeah, next to the mountains as well. Oh, hello. Boar stone? That... Yeah, that's a boar stone. Actually, we, we don't... we're low on boar meat. Can you hear you? Well, that's one way to start a stream. It, we that was a to... one star. Then again, well. I feel like we were very unlucky to realize too late that we was not play meadows we sailed into due yeah. to how dark it got. Just a series of unfortunate events that turned out to be, well, decently survivable. Okay, there's a, I, I, there's a lot of meadows here. The river. And dark forests. Wait, that that's a different island. You know what? Let, let's let's swim across, or build by the oak. Yeah. And should we? Could we build on the oak? Sort of. If something breaks the oaks, it breaks the house too. I say let's make a hut here. Then we explore the other little island next to us. <laughs> okay, this looks like a good place. We have the mountain over there. We have the swamp over there. And yeah, we have a good amount if, of distance. I, it might not be a base location yet. We may need we, we need to see if there's a, a dungeon in a swamp. Or at, le at least I hope the swamp at least have to test us where the bone mass is. Yeah. Okay, uh... And now it's a new day, but we still need to make that hut for... We need a resting bonus. Yeah. Mm. And uh, let me help you. Okay, well, there's more meaning to put it on stilts, but okay. <laughs> well, if we, we, we may not need to have it on steel. The dirt floor will suffice in this case. <clears throat> hmm. Oh, you you build where I did I did not hoe. Oops. Okay, we can just go around the boulder at the moment. Get rid of this one as well. Oh. Looks at least like uh, here would be somewhat easier to make a good encampment with the palisades and all that. Yeah. Like it's, it's not too much mining and racing ground. So yeah, it, it is actually at least a decent outpost. Yeah, you, um, <laughs> you broke the workbench. <laughs> Just as I was about to put in the last cor uh, corner here. We're not Sorry, the boss. Side. And now I don't have enough wood <laughs> to replace it. Here we go. This looks a little bit small. I think you want to use uh, this one as a door. Yep. Okay, uh, pick that up. Still looks damn small. It's supposed to be small. Okay. I must too small, I say. <clears throat> now we can raise the roof and maybe lengthen it another time. We'll probably have to put down something here, a uh, forge, to repair our well stuff, unless we just go back through a portal with it. I say, I say, let's put a portal in here, then explore the other area here. Yeah. 
before we make uh, too much of this. Hmm. Okay. Just as I was about to put it down. <laughs> okay. Yeah, not. It doesn't look very Viking, is this? This is more like a hobbit hole. And yeah, if we not put the fi that. if we put the fire in the middle, it yeah will give us even less room. Yeah. <laughs> One, two. And come on, line up. Three. Yeah, now I say, let's put a portal here. Let me see if it is a good encampment or not. For at least it's a good portal spot for now. <laughs> Just give it a moment to connect. There we go. But yeah, you see. Oh yeah, we, we do. Yeah, you're right. We do gonna need to replace the the. Uh, yeah, we gonna need the materials to replace the damn boat. <clears throat> okay. Uh, just for when rain comes. I actually should be able to just put that to there. Yep. Okay, that should yet. be enough. <clears throat> oh, yeah, we can say fancy for the main base. Yeah, oh, you're right. I, I will not be able to go into the portal now because of the iron. Yeah, you just put you, no, just put down a quick chest then. Yeah, I gotta do that. <laughs> now I feel like I should have grabbed that in earlier. Well, it's... if I had put that on the boat, then it would do sunken as well. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah. Risk and rewards with the boat and such. Yeah. Let's see. No need for boar scraps or leather scraps. Mm. Actually, do, do you have. Uh, let's say boar scraps. Boar scraps. Where do you put them? Okay. I'm gonna try something. <laughs> Hmm. Actually, no need for the fine wood at all at the moment. Uh, yeah, we, we really need to put up signs about what is where. I'm gonna fix something here that should be of use. Hmm. Can we just stick the fish on there? Or... There you go. Now we have uh, more comfort. Uh, made a rug, I presume? Uh, look on the wall. Over the campfire. Oh, oh yeah, a banner. That helps, that gives one comfort as well, because now it's ten instead of nine. Indeed. Okay. Uh, we're going to have to hunt a few uh, deer to get enough <laughs> hide again. Keeping the wood on me, just in case. Where? There's all the resin. Yeah, we have more than plenty of that. Uh, we need 20 for a new boat. Can't... Well, yeah, uh, luckily enough, we can't... <laughs> well, yeah, we can move the nails to portals, luckily enough. So, question is, do we have enough to make enough nails? Uh, let's see, we need 80 nails, and you make 20 from each ingot. Oh. So we need four, and we have one tin short, it seems. I have one tin here, uh, I'm putting inside here, along with some copper. Okay, sounds like we should have... <clears throat> Sounds like we should have uh, gotten that tin whilst we were at the merchant. 
Yeah. Man, what Dude, are bones doing here? Hmm. We will not even be able, we will not be able to move through the portal. And who could have ended in the water? Yeah. I'll take that. But yeah, <laughs> also people, use this as a lesson. Be very careful when you're looking for a place to land during the night. Got yeah, two copper. Oh dear. There and there. That actually reminds me of something I learned in a uh, Minecraft with all the uh, mods, all the mod seven. Oh. Uh, apparently, you can make cheaper uh, bronze for create by just throwing copper and tin into a. Uh, <clears throat> into the mixer, similar to how you can make cheaper andesite alloy. Okay. Okay. Um, let's see. 30 fine woods. That we have. Okay, we just need five more deer hides. Then we have a uh, boat number two. <laughs> yeah, that, that we can hopefully get uh, from exploring. Okay, uh, in the meantime... Check on, on the bees. Oh, so where's the portal? The new uh, one? At the... Around the corner here. Next to the beds. All right. <coughs> Why do I have honey on me? I'm going to put that away. <laughs> yeah, because I threw that at you because I have a full stack. <laughs> or had a full stack. No. Oh. Okay, then this looks a lot better now. Right. Coming over. But yeah, let's explore and hunt deer. But they're gonna, we're gonna need to actively hunt during explorations. Except Loxus. Yeah. But yeah, they have the right bow. Just not the right ammo. <laughs> yeah. I'm still carrying wooden arrows. We have the flint heads back at the base. We probably should have grabbed a stack of those. Yeah, it, that's one stop order. Um, some stutters. Yeah, a little bit stutter. Do they? There's many people playing Valheim again. But we haven't had that single disconnection <laughs> as of yet, which is good. Okay, nice little thing. Um, let's see. Don't be afraid to swim this little for... It's yeah, more the wet it... uh, effect that I'm annoyed with. Yeah, same. Though it can be good to get a little bit of, uh, you know, this wind training. Yeah. I'll just grab that flint as well. Okay. It looks like this is going to be a really big meadows. So there should be plenty of deer meadows around. Or black forest for both of the deers. Yeah. And more boar. <laughs> more boar, more boar, boar, more boar. <laughs> okay. So, uh, yeah, big black forest, it seems. Oh, well. Sliding down. Let's see. I'm curious how big this island is going to be. Yeah, it's at least two islands at the moment, I guess. So there's some copper here. Okay. Don't forget to mark that down on the map. Oh, good you said that. How you mark that down now? Okay, carrot seeds. Always useful to have more. Blueberries. <laughs> the great world that apparently does not like blueberries because he threw a rock at them. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, Tistols. If you find a group of those, don't forget to mark those as well. I did. <laughs> I... No. Uh, at least they're easy to find. Yeah, the, the glow. Yeah. They grew in 
Black Forest and Swamp, but I rarely grab those in the swamp since they're usually very good, I say, emergently guidance in the night. Yeah. Let's see. Is this going to open up into meadows? Yes. Oh, copper. Bones. I just marked out. Ooh. Deer. Bunch of them. And I found something here that will be of help. Yep. Hit the Mark tree. That down. And it's gone. Okay, let me at least grab from the others. Let's see, I think I got at least one, maybe a second. Oh, yeah, I definitely yeah. got a second. I found a burial chamber. Okay. I marked hmm. it down. And here comes one of the guards. I'll let that one star be, I'll, otherwise I'll end up chasing it all across the island. Let's see, I got two hides from that. Ooh. Wait, what? Oh. Um. Helium? Yeah. Come on here, I am. Look over here. I see. I found something copper deposit. awesome first. Then it's also been horrifying. <laughs> Look Dude. past the stone ruins. Wait, what is that? Oh. Ruling camp. That's a big. That's probably the biggest flat ruins I've seen in a while, or ever. Yeah, that would be a nice base if not for the foolings and next to the plains, Hillian. Yeah. Okay, just clearing out. Hmm. The stragglers. No yeah, boxes. Let's not linger here. That's a no big boxes. one with four f fires. Yeah. They might have something we may want in the future, but. It's too That's... recent to co do, go close to mark it down. Mm. There's one on the. Ah. walking away. That Skeeto flying away. I see cloudberries. I will grab those. Oh, it's coming towards you. Both are coming towards you. The Skeeto behind. There we go. One feeling we can handle, but not a camp. Come on, you little shit. I'm gonna grab the cloudberries, then I'm gonna go over and help you. I'm waiting for it to attack, but it just... <laughs> it hit me between two attacks. Okay. Uh, he dropped... No, oh, he did Black drop metal. a bit of metal, but I'm full. Uh, I'll, I'll just chuck out the flint, there's no need I, for I that. Took it. I took it. I had room. Okay. However, we can't teleport it, so we'll have to put it in the chest later. Yeah, and sail it back. Uh, yeah, or to whatever suitable base location we may find. This is a big plains. Yeah. Okay. And that's kind of concerning. Come on, there we go. One hide. That means we need two more. Yeah, then we can finally start to make a new boat and sail away from here. Uh, we should probably grab the portal. <laughs> For I don't yep. think this is might be a very good island. Like, sure, we found a swamp, but that swamp seemed a little small. Oh, oh, damn it. I was just to say that, uh, Mosquito. Yeah, we can still look through it for any... <clears throat> For any, uh, oh, there we go. Any crypts in there? It yeah, probably won't be the boss uh, around. Yeah, hopefully, I hope we at least find a runestone that a vague visor to tell us where it is. For if you know where Bonemass is, we may know a good location to make a base. Far okay. away from these buggers. <laughs> oh, yeah, or at least we know. Where the plane, where is, if there's a big planes for when we, well, want to go find one. Yeah, if you need more black metal. So, 
Let's deal with these little buggers. Are there any more recipes with necktails beyond just cooking them? And another uh, boar stone. Poison resistance. Okay. We Which is need very useful. In the swamp and bone mass. I'll just mark this one. I got one you store deer. Okay. Bunch of deer meat and four hide. Okay, we have enough for a new boat. All right, <laughs> so, uh, yeah. We will explore the swamp a bit quickly. Just to see if there's at least a vague reason for a... I doubt a crypt is this one, in this one. But a big wizard will help a lot. Uh, wait. Do you see what I'm seeing here? Yep, a little house. <laughs> right down the hill from the one we built. Uh, oh, that's painful. <laughs> but yeah, oh, well. if there's something... It has some potential here with this hill. Easily defended and a good docking area here. Yep. Probably is this again I feel like the swamp might be a bit too small. It'll still make a good outpost for the mountain and the plains. Uh, probably we have a big enough mountain for silver. Otherwise it's a bad mountain as well. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> at the very least we might be able to get wolves out of it. Okay. Yeah, we kinda need wolves for better beds. So let's just make a quick extension so we can put down some actual beds. Uh, do it on the other side of the fire, I guess. Uh, we put that in this metal in here. <laughs> uh, I just realized we can just go through the portal and sleep. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, me dumb. It, it is a good idea otherwise uh, on some outpost. We will uh, probably want to do that. Provided we have uh, access to enough things to do. Get off my back. <laughs> Another monkey on your back, but a helium. Oh dear. And I'm going to need to empty my bags. <coughs> then I'm ready for some swap exploring. For, again, we found a big visit that was where Bomas is. We will have a good location to make a good early base. Yeah. Uh, let's see. These are done smelting. But inventory is full, so let me just. Let's see. Blueberries. Keeping that. Boar meat. Yeah, we got some stingers from the mosquitoes. This is. Good for arrows. I guess if we put them in here. Uh, bone bits. I guess we put the pistols <laughs> in here. This in here. This over here. Yeah, we, we're gonna need a better, better kitchen for so many reasons. Yeah. Because if there is in here. Um, put those there. I think we already have thistles in one of the boxes here. And there. What happened is, did you plant the seeds? Yeah, the onion seeds, yes. Ah, uh, good, good. Oh, yeah, now I see. I, how the heck did I take them from the turnips? <laughs> and you put them very far away from each other. You can't put them closer. Yeah, but better to be sure. And while uh, it was dark. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Good point. Some trophies to hang up. <clears throat> More stone, but. Uh, I'll be carrying some stone in case we need to make a campfire. 
It says you need two wood and five stone, so... Must have had to get some stone with you. There we go. We can make the new one. Anything oh, yeah. else? Something important to remember, Voss. The iron is in the house. So okay. we better not forget that. <laughs> once let's the boat is built. Yeah. Also, let's go explore this swamp. See if there are any crypts. I can't see any at the moment, but that's because these this, I can't see through the trees. Uh, it's, I think it might be too small. But again, a vague visor may be the best thing we can find there, possibly. If we, if we do find a crypt, we still need to kill uh, the Elder for the yeah, key. Yeah, to get in. That's one, that's one thing we didn't bring over, I think, or I might have stashed it. Uh, I think we skipped that. Since we we need a reason to kill him again. And again, an example of just blocking and st <laughs> staggering at an archer. Uh, we'll have to keep an eye out for the leeches as well. Poisonous yeah, bastards. Yeah, just keep that one store one. Yep, I can hear one moving, or that's a muck or sludge or whatever it is again. Need some food. Some entrails. Ooh, turnip seeds. I will grab those. <laughs> Skeleton. Here we go. The most annoying thing about the swamp is that you're almost guaranteed to get the wet debuff. You always get the wet debuff here. The only thing for you to get dry here is to stand on something or have the bonfire. Yeah. This is, won't get put out by rain. Why, why did I... Oh, I must have swam a bit. Okay. Thistles, okay. but we have enough. The swamp is definitely easier now with this better food. Yeah. But we still it's... need to be careful. I'm seeing no green lights from the <clears throat> torches. Because crypts have torches that are bur that burn green next to them. Yeah, or right in front of them. Only 35 jump? Oh wait, yes, yes, yeah, I'm just running. Ahem, you forgot something. Not the stump. Yeah. Uh, refresh that. Here we go. Might as well get ourselves some ancient bark whilst we're here. Yeah, at least I think we can teleport through it. Ooh, I found a little hot. Some... a few arrows in it. And it's empty. Okay. It's right next to a muck tree. <laughs> uh, guck. Yep. <laughs> it's junk anyways, and so is this biome, it seems. Uh, like, not, not even r ruins for... Wait, there's something over here. Okay, give me a moment. Might be a rune stone or a vague visa location. Are you good to stomp, I hope? Yeah. Good, like, I want stomp is not beefy, but if you leave way too many stomp around, it can cause issues. The, okay, the blob... <laughs> and the blob just fell through the world for me. And then it fell back. I, same here, but I did kill it. With weird... I guess it might be... 
some minor connection issues but it's a least better before for otherwise i usually would have disconnected by now yeah there is a stone here okay just a regular rune stone here then unless there's a vague visor hidden somewhere here Oop, missed that Yeah. And get rid of these two. Okay, what's this say? It, hmm. it speaks about uh, oh, big. who the dragon were. Hmm? Uh, it's home to a race of now, you know, the noble creatures. There's a dragon creeping up from the left. Great towers, touch of clouds. Now they sunk many hundred years deep. <laughs> okay. Probably more interesting to read than that, but it <laughs> plays a bit hostile. Yeah, at least it saves in a condemnium, or whatever it was called again. A compendium? But okay. Yeah. But yeah, now we know this one was not good. Yeah, we can at least still check out the mountain. Probably start by just skirting along its out uh, its edges to see how big it is. Let's not do it by the planes. Getting these for in case we need another spare boat. Yeah, I say this. We should probably. Hmm. I wonder. I think, I think we are strong enough to fight the elder. We just need some fire arrows. Yeah, I'd say we were plenty strong against for the elder. So, uh, we... yeah, we have about one hour remaining. So I say, why not kill, make the boat sail to the elder, make a little encampment somewhat near, not too near, and kill him. And that way we get the key. Uh, we could go. Yeah, we. There's two that we know of. One to the east of here, but I get the feeling that it's likely two or three islands away but there is another one to the north of our starting island yeah, that's a lot closer oh doesn't say that for me i don't see that but if it's north hmm. of our starting island that might be worth it yeah back in the plane some cloud berries <laughs> oh i hear for we need those for some cooking like, uh, for many recipes, like salad. And you're not uh, picking them the up. Yep, yeah, inventory full again. Uh, I'll toss out that. I'm picking them up. Don't worry. Okay. Yeah, one little side effect about the silver hammers that we're using is that they knock them back enough that we need to run up a bit to be able to hit them again. There you go, grabbing the black metal and coin. Let's see, what yeah, does this let's... read? Yeah, I say this, <laughs> we, we, this is... We want probably to uh, go somewhere else. Okay, furling there. Okay, let's check out the mountain. <clears throat> Uh, normally we would need <laughs> normally at this stage we would likely need uh, a potion of frost resistance or something but since we have these capes that we're wearing we are cold resistant yeah you need wolf locks or at least raven to be able to resist the cold as a cape otherwise you need the silver armor also known as wolf armor yeah let's see uh May need some minor repairs on all of this, 96-95%. And yeah, wolf for cape, resistant versus frost. I hate wolves. No, you mean uh, donors for another cape? Or rug? In our case, since rugs do not longer stack, a bed. For ah, like yeah. a future bed, since the dragon bed is a better. And I see obsidian. Oh, and wolf. 
There we go. Uh, I'll toss that. I'll toss that. And yeah, wolf meat. Wolf skewer. Okay. Okay. What do I, I gonna need to throw out something? Okay. Deer meat I can throw away. Uh, bones can be thrown. Yeah, obsidian we can use this to make arrows. Let's grab this, yeah, for... I have a feeling this would be very good for many bosses. Oh, really? I don't want a skeleton trophy. <laughs> so what have we here? This looks like one of those druid stone stacks or something. I think, I think they are gravy or stone or something. The Vikings did that as well on mountains. More obsidian. And a rune stone. Let's see, anything interesting? Uh, there are friends in Valheim, but you seek them among your enemies. Old friends, firekin, moon singers. For centuries they have hunted alongside you. Now you must remind them of the old covenant between your people and theirs. Okay. Flesh is their delight and must be your offering. I think I know what's going on. Werewolves? Well, that, that too, but wolves, you need to tame with uh, raw meat. Oh, uh, yeah. Moon singers. Like... <clears throat> but fire king. I, I know the cultist werewolves shoot fire at you. Uh, uh oh. Uh oh. Breaks. Where did it end up? Or no, it's still here. Yeah. Hmm. It's a pretty big one. Uh, yeah. <laughs> you want a good bow and good arrows to deal with these pests? Yeah. Um, In our case, we don't have good arrows. Uh, oh, let's we, see. We're getting. Oh. I'll throw a bit of wood out. <clears throat> With these, we can make frost arrows. Uh, I see a house. Okay. I'll pick up some more obsidian. I'm going to be careful for, for some reason. Golems love houses. <laughs> well, they don't want to be homeless forever. Oh, oh, oh. I, we f I found an egg. I found an egg. Mark it, since, you know, they are heavy. Yep. All right. I found some treasure, <laughs> but they are not important at the moment. Uh, there's a bunch of drakes pestering me. Luckily, due to the cape, they can't actually frost me. This they is can good. Be, they can do quite a bit of damage. So I'll just eat that, eat that. And that. Whoa, there's many! I've counted at least three. They might, they might be guarding the nest. Yeah, I think they are doing that. Okay, one more on this. There we go. <laughs> okay. We'll take that freeze gland. Oh, and I'm out of arrows. Uh, okay, I can't craft them normally like this. Here we go. Yeah, I'll, I'll definitely go grab those flint head arrows. And yeah, here's the dragon egg. Yeah, I have some arrows you can take. Uh... Here you go. Flinted arrows. Drop it behind you. There we go. Thank you. Uh... Okay, give me the freeze glance. Might as well help out here. Yep. This is another important thing. When two people try to organize between each other so you can carry as much as possible. Thought I heard something. Uh, I think that's a trick in the distance. <clears throat> and this is a mountain too small for silver. Yep. 
and okay, pull on that. I grabbed it. Okay. Oh, hello. And more planes down there. Yeah. I... Hmm. Bit of a bad island, but not bad for a hunting lodge. Yeah, that, it, this fair place could only be a hunting lodge, and I would not be surprised if we find better places. But for now, I guess we should return to the base, unpack, and prepare the boats. Yeah. And let's let's sail to the elder, kill the elder, and get the key, so we have some progress we can be proud of. <laughs> okay, southward back to the portal. It's north, dumbass. I was wondering, are you sure? <laughs> I didn't okay. even mark it on the map. Those wolf fangs will be useful for upgrading our wolf armor. Until we can get more stuff for the linen armor and padded stuff. But yeah, which of the elders do you want us to, to sail to? I want to try the, the northern one. It'll be further away. Oh. <clears throat> hey, let me put that right back on again. <laughs> I was, I took it off to be speedier, but then that stupid thing took about a third of my health away. Okay. This direction-ish. Mushroom. I'm already full, though. Yeah, same. I can't really throw out too much miles out now. Okay, bunch of deers as well. Come here, you. Come here, Bambi. And of course, it's going to rain as well. <clears throat> okay, maybe we'll spot another copper deposit, but I think we should have enough with the ones that we have already found. Yeah, like, we should be able to find more... Uh tin and such in our a main base as well. Hmm. At least enough for uh, the nails, I hope. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, see. main base, get gather the nails, build a boat, and uh, yeah, sail north. So there's, there's, the, there's the dragon bed. Need feathers, nails, and just wood. Yeah, but we need iron nails. Okay. <clears throat> what a so rough next. start. Like, sure, it started out well. Made me bring out some good food, but. Oh dear. Yep. The disasters. Them fish jumping onto land. Oh uh, yeah, could have gone better, but definitely could have gotten worse as well. Yeah, I, I, we could have lost the portal pots in the boat if you had put them there. Yeah. Okay. But, yeah. N n if you see planes, you have the small boat, or at least you see loxes. <laughs> they, in our case, they spawned afterwards. Yeah. Avoid. Okay, onions are not ready. Okay. Time to repair. So that cacophony again. Okay. <clears throat> okay, I guess. Nothing are like you that. sure there's one north? A elder in the north. Uh yeah, I have I have a marker for it. it's about see. Yeah, oh, you for, can I, tag I, off the as, as well. I, I I see one in the south, uh, southeast, but not in the north. Okay. okay. I put down a. Okay. Ah, no, it's, okay, yeah, that's that's closer. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, actually, yeah. We, we just need to get materials and build it by the river, then sail up, up sail up. 
Okay. Uh... So yeah, then it's. Mm. Oh, now it's question. What the heck? We... Uh, do we have enough to make uh, uh, more portals? Um. Let me see. Actually, yeah. Uh... I was about. We. I was about to say we can break down one, but uh, let's not. Yeah, let's not. Yeah, what do you even name the other portal? Uh, the one that we used, I named Explore. And right. I think the one that's... The first one I think we named Swamp. Uh, I think you mean Trader? Yeah, or, Trader. Yeah, Merchant or something. Yeah, something I can't get into that. Uh, We definitely need to organize a bit more with all of this. It's wolf meat, intestines, and yeah, arrows. Just a bunch of arrows. Okay, 100 should do for a good while. I uh, so we look forward to. Uh some proper black chest. Like, there's an iron chest, but I feel like black chests are better. So they only use regular wood instead of fine wood. And black metal you can easier find more of, unlike iron. Okay. Let's actually do a different little thing with the portals instead of just constantly making pairs. So, yeah, yeah. let's see. Crater. Yeah, I feel like we should re... Actually, I got an idea. We should rename the Explore one to uh, oh, something else. Yeah, we can probably leave it blank. That way it will automatically connect. Uh, no, that doesn't, that doesn't work, I think. So we need a short name for the other one, like a... Well, what should we call that one? Uh, just... We could just use a single letter, like E. Yeah, might as well. Uh, are we go... You know what? Uh, I... Are we, are we go through and rename it? Okay, rename it to what? E. Uh, e. Okay. Then, we'll, uh, then we should uh, mark it on the map. Actually, yeah, we could also use that. To... There we go. E. More over there. E. I, I marked it on the map as E as well. Now. There we go. Now let's see if this worked. Yeah, oh, wait, I realized. Killian, we need to build a boat here. The iron uh, is here. Uh, we. How much iron is it? Four, and we needed to make the stone cutter. Okay. Uh, which way is the wind at the moment? Hmm. Uh, let's see. Wind is blowing decently. Might as well grab the black metal as well then. And oh. actually, probably best to first rest up. Yeah, let's put I that in. I, I, and I have even unpacked everything I have on me. Okay. Mm. Yeah. That iron gonna be important. For all we know, that the uh, elder thing may have a good base location near a swamp. Let's see. Boats. Yep, all of that. Is it obsidian here? I put the gold here. Let's put these here. I put 
put these here. I put seed in Helion's sleeping box. Almost already out of turnip stew. Wonderful. Sarcasm. Okay. <clears throat> okay, we make the boats, we sail up with the iron, even though it's only a little at the moment. Then we make so we can make the stone cutter. Yeah, okay. which will make it easier to make a fortified base. Okay. And other things like a better half fire. You're going to the trailer? Uh, I renamed this one. Oh, okay. So we I, can I just swap this. one portal through the different names to make it easier on the, our resources. Yeah, uh, otherwise we could go like camp one, camp two, camp three. Yeah. But uh, that, for now, this one can be called E. Let's see, did you grab the air metal? Uh, not yet. I will do that then. There we go. Mm. What is... Okay, that's just a Draugr. <laughs> Apparently the Draugrs are picking a fight with the boars. I am not surprised. Yeah, I'll put down the boat here. Then we can just sail out. Yeah, okay, it's good wind as well. And in a way, this is also good that the way we also see if there are other lands in that area. Whatever the side we say. I see there's an island that you haven't explored over there. Not too far yeah. from us. Okay, I can see it over to the east. Okay, this is a little bit brutal that the entire stone gets splattered. Okay, here we go. Takes a bit to get moving. I wonder what kind of island is that? If that I'll is Black in... Forest Island, that could be a good base. Yeah, let's check that out next time then. We have the portal. Oh, oh. Steer too much. There we go. This should get us through safely enough. Stutter. <laughs> so we could... Actually, yeah, we could sail past that island and just keep going north until we get to the Elder. And the, the other one that is closer at the moment. And I can already see land. Wait, does, does it just connect back to this island or something? I think it does. I think that's the plain one. So let's sail north. I think that's yes. the... Yeah, that's, I see plane trees, so let's say north words. Oh, yes, that's a plane rock over there. Oh, uh, wait, it... What is... It, is this might be it, one long planes. Possibly. No, I see swamp trees. Extremely small. Yeah. Too small. It looks like it does have a mountain. Very high. That maybe has silver. Yeah, we just need to know how wide it is. Yeah, but I say let's not explore it since it's... We don't want to land in planes. Yeah, not again. <laughs> At least not until we are ready. Yeah, it looks like... It looks like the biome, the land biome, stretch out a lot further into the water now. Which I'm, <laughs> I'll be plenty of happy with because that means less space for the stupid serpents to spawn. Yeah, so less chance of breaking the boat. I think this has always been a thing, just... I think in one of our earlier ones, we had the unlockiness. There was a slim ocean between two islands. Yeah. Yes, I do not like open water. Same like... I don't like it with this small boat. With a long boat, I feel somewhat safer since it's faster and stronger. Yep. But only provided I have good wind. And, and again, turn, some turn, setting. Turn. 
Oh, no, not towards the planes. Away from the planes. <laughs> Away from death. Away from pain, planes of pain. That's as you were saying to dodge a rock or something. Wait, oh, yeah, this is a big ass planes as well. Yeah. Yeah, we could probably build a base between the rocks. <laughs> Just suspend it. Rather not, for those rocks can break. Yeah, the locks can't break stone. Don't know if furlings look, can. Oh. Look to the other side yeah. of the boat. Oh, that's one of those turtles. Should we... Uh, let's mark it, but I don't... <laughs> I'm already... Okay. With how close it is to these... Uh... I will mark it. They are marked. Uh. Furlings and... Okay, Black Forest, that's good. That's good. Uh, hey! That's a big boy. Alien? Yeah? This may connect to our, almost to our own main island. Actually, yes, there, there's an area of that that I hadn't explored. That's a glow of the Great Dwarf spawner, I believe. Actually, that is good, for that means we have a sort of just a short swim to here. Actually, now, are, there, are the Great Dwarf spawners purple, or...? Uh, they are purple glowing. Okay, so that is one of them. There's a burial grounds here. Uh, oh, yeah, it is a burial ground. Make a quick mark of that. Okay, so this was not a tiny island, sadly enough. Or maybe it is. But uh, had this been on a small island, it could be a candidate for an island base, but... Uh, I'm just glad that this is a, at least land, somewhat land-connected... Um, oh dear. This can hey. be complicated. Okay, we can get through here, but let's do it not on maximum velocity. Uh, uh, I think... Yeah, you can't even get a longboat here unless you somehow get rid of the, all this stone and I say tin. Okay, there are shallows here. Yeah, uh, yeah th this would can... be too shallow for a longboat as well. Uh, longboats can handle this, actually. Probably it's, it's too much of the rocks and these little bumps around here, which could Speaking be a problem. Bump. You'll land on a rock. This happened to me the other day with a longboat with a tiny rock. I was able to get it loose, finally. Then I just destroyed the rock. <laughs> this will not happen <laughs> again. Okay. Uh -oh. it... Here we go. Okay, not too bad. Not too bad damaged. Yeah, it's only when the boat goes poof twice that you are in actual real danger of sinking. Yeah. It's just that the locks were strong enough to punch through both layers at once. <laughs> yeah, they, they are mighty. Eh? I say this, if we were to find the area where we make a plane base or the, you know the plane boss is, maybe tame locks on that island to use them to right through the foolings. <laughs> yeah, we can tame them with the cloud berries, I think it was. Cloud berries, barley. I usually use cloud berries for, well, you'd rather use the barley for yourself. Yeah. Okay, we're going to have less favorable winds once we turn south. That should still be good. Oh, we're going to the other island then. I, I thought that's what you wanted. Uh, I just wanted down here to get the cop, uh, the, the iron and all that, but the, this elder is now closer to us currently. Yes. But yeah, originally I thought the, the northern was better until I realized, oh right, iron. We are taking a little bit of a risk with taking that with us, but at least it's not <laughs> in the boat. Yeah, I'm holding on to it. And plus, we're getting to explore the edges of this island. Uh, 
I think that's opening up into planes again. Uh, I don't like that. And yeah, the Elder here is definitely a few islands away, I think. Yeah, so I would say we can sail north. I think we have the wind for it. So that would yeah. be a quite a long way. Yeah, let, let's just turn around here. Yeah, I thought we're taking a risk going past that furling village. Yeah, this is the case where I'd rather have us sail to a shore so we know we're safe and we can park at. Planes, no, it's not worth it. I think we're going to need a, uh, to park somewhere to get through the night. At least we are next to the Black Forest. And headed for the, the meadows. Bit of a big wave, that one. Oh, careful now. You're kind of just going back and forth between steering left and right. <laughs> Yeah, that happens sometimes. Ahead. Okay, dude. I have a mark to the north of us that says that there is an island to the northeast from here. Uh, oh, yeah, I, see, I think I see a little dot right up ahead. And I yeah. see a Draugr village. Yeah, next to Draugrville. Should we take over the Draugr village? Um. Not at the moment, I'd say. For the moment, we should probably get our metals to safety and the island where, the, where we know where the Elder is closer. Oh. I thought of, uh, we could kill them, make a portal and uh, sleep through the night. That way we also have a... I guess you call it a... turning uh, against us. Uh, how what do we call it? A repair station? Yeah, true, but we can build those anywhere. True. Uh, and the wind is now, wind is now officially against us. Because with that, with how it is now, we can't go north or full speed to the west. Um, let, let's not try maneuvering through that again. Can I yeah, let's, catch uh... the wind just enough to get us northbound? Yes, I can. Okay, let's go past the Draugr village, and let's see. The land is thin enough there that we could just rush across, if need be. Hmm. Rush Actually, towards to the, the trader? Uh, could also try that. Uh, uh, let's see here, otherwise. Hmm. All right, I should remember. I I can't take the method through the portal. Yeah. Mm. I see a tower with the archers in the tower. Okay. <laughs> or, yeah, there's two of them in there. Someone's taking shots, but it's at wildlife. Okay. And I'll keep the food as I have it now. 84 health is good as it is. And let's see. Yeah, there is land in the far distance there, I can see. Oh yeah, I see what you mean. We could get over there and place down a portal and a box. Hmm. I don't want to risk going across this big a stretch of sea. Uh, actually, yeah, let's not. Let's just sail all the way up to the next boss. <laughs> yeah, I think a different way I could name these streams is to... Uh, let's see, what was it called again? Uh, Thassalophobics <laughs> play Valheim, which is the fear of open sea. Yeah, in some games I will not fear it, but here, Danish noodles. Yeah. Like, 
with the longboats, it they would be a lot less dangerous. But still, just it's the chance is, uh, <laughs> yeah, unnerving. Yeah, especially when we don't have good arrows, even. If we had we... dead mosquito arrows or obsidian arrows, then we could definitely take them on. Yeah. And we don't have that sadly enough. Well, he might be resistant to poison, apparently, but he hates ice arrows, apparently. Okay. Is it kind of surprising? Little hunting lodge over there. More like a hunting camp the, with the low uh, sleeping areas. Yeah, and uh, a little bee house. And that looks high enough to be a little bit of mountain over there, but looking at the map, it's probably not big enough. Actually, if that bit connects to that bit and that continues on, like that could be long enough, maybe not wide enough for silver. I think the one right in front of us might maybe weakly have silver. But that's a big, perhaps. I, I get the feeling that, that there's just a spine of mountain running through the unexplored uh, area to the left. Hmm. We can we can investigate that later. For now, uh, yeah, we're just going north and home. And to the Elder. Gotta pay respect to yeah. your Elders by killing the... <laughs> the, the by, kill, yeah, by killing big brutes. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, getting wavy. Yeah, I think also something that makes me nervous with seas is the fact that I get seasick. Actually, first time I was on a boat that I remember and fished, I caught a good, big fish. But the first time I was on the boat, I actually vomited. Yeah, it, it, I don't have trouble with big boats like cruise or ferries. Uh, don't think I've ever been on a full cruise ship. But yeah, with fairies, uh, not. Small ones yeah, I do have uh, problems with. Oh, puffer fish. Okay. Hard turn to shore. Yeah, that w might have been a bit of a sea serpent weather. Don't feel rest anymore. I, yeah, we're I gonna need something. to have a. At some point, find a better base we can have a very comfy home. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, we're definitely going so, to need to look at the mountains on our on the island here because they seem to be going for quite a distance. Yeah, they could have something useful if we are lucky. Yeah, we will need those. Uh, what were they called again? The. The sensing stick to find uh, to find silver. Yeah, actually, not always. But, uh, my latest map, I have found silver poking out of the ground three times on the same mountain. <laughs> True, but it'll still be easier to find with one. Yeah, for I have a better habit of finding silver poking out. This is kind of hilarious. This means that you can get it without, but betting on it you find it without that thing is probably a bit of a gamble. Yeah. Okay, there's I a troll cave you. there. Yeah, it's a troll cave. Hmm. Hmm. I'm not sure how useful the sneaking set made from troll hide would really be. That, that's probably more useful early on. There's a shaman fighting something there. Hmm. Uh, but yeah, once we have the stone cutter, the first the next thing we should probably make would be uh, rain again. Or no, not rain. Why did it say that you are red? Where I was just almost counting down. Next thing after stone cutter is a longboat. Yeah. Because compared to this, that's a speedboat. Yeah, even when paddling, the longboat is faster than this. Okay, lost the wind. OK, 
catch a little bit more as we go around the corner. Yeah, just careful, I don't sail into the rock. But uh, here we can actually sail along the night. Says the, the, we, this is safe for sure. Yeah. I just currently until we are ready, I will not want to sailing near planes, especially not at night. Yeah. And uh, about um. boats, there's a boat wreck here. Yeah, I was about to say, is there something standing there? Uh, if I recall correctly, we can find stuff buried here or something? Yeah, no, let's not do it here at the moment. Yeah, just maneuver through the rocks. Okay, bit of damage, but no serious damage. Yeah, not yet at least. And when the wind turned again. So favorable. Yeah. Turn, turn, yes. turn. Yeah, I was just say to just be careful. There's a lot of rocks here. Yeah, and yeah, when you be sail in this game, don't always go max speed, but every bear is just, it, it, it's safe to paddle. Yeah. Get gear going for a bath. Now it's running for dear life. <laughs> Gods. Okay. We're getting there. Oh, oh yeah, we, we got quite a decent and... Uh, uh, oversteered. Distance. Wait, I see a campfire on... Uh, the elder location. Yeah, that, that I put there to mark it in case it didn't give the uh, boss marker. Ah, okay, okay. Okay. There is something just about sailing in this game like this. Like, there is a, just a... It is, in part... Ooh, it's getting pretty dark. It is, in part, relaxing, but it's also a certain tension in the air. Yeah. Like, never let you go down too much. Oh, I think the wind is going to pull us onto... Yep. Oh, uh, just about not. <laughs> Boop. Oh, dear. Okay, now it's getting hard to see things. Hmm. Okay, let me just slow down some. And stop the zigzagging a bit. There we go. Ah, you mod something else here, I see, with a dot. Probably another land I spotted across or something. Yeah, he thinks there might be something, but unsure. And oh, there is a tiny island. Yeah. <laughs> Too Definitely small for Definitely not what I saw, though. Okay, for a moment I thought that was a fish flying real freaking high, but no, it's a bird. A seagull. And a water deer. So I should probably just make a torch again. And I should it won't help much. <laughs> yeah, we, we also gonna need to get that form going better, like just form but many, just make the farm bigger, plant a lot of turnips and all that, closer so we get as much as possible when we're gonna need it. There's a rune stone on a single little island here. Oh yeah! Oh, old location. Okay, that... Yep. That's not good. Okay, let's land. That, yeah, let, let's get to land and repair. Or, in this case, more get to rock. Oh, the wind is turned again. Okay, parking these things is always a bit of a nuisance, since the momentum. 
Uh, yeah, now I can't reach that. Should <laughs> I leave it there? Uh, might as well. I. <laughs> Are we going to have a case of Gullet and Guybrush again? You missed there a spot, bonk. <laughs> repair. We missed a spot, bonk. Repair. Can you repeat that? <laughs> you missed a spot. Now you damaged it. <laughs> Again, actually. <laughs> yeah. I still don't get it. I missed the locks and hit you and the boat instead. Like you literally missed the broadside of a side of a barn. <laughs> yeah. He moved just in time. Uh, I, sh I should have caught that on the replay. Ooh. and. Okay, water will carry um, us over. Yeah. Uh, yeah let's hopefully. Gotta wait for the next wave. Uh, <laughs> the sailing music just hard stops. Okay, I think it can wriggle us off of this. There we go. <laughs> I should have put. I should edit in a, in a, a record scratch there. <laughs> uh, actually, let's see. One hour fifty. Or, or, yeah, one hour fifty on the recording, since we stream. We stream for two hours and five minutes, technically, with the pre-stream. Uh, yeah. Paper. Should we extend it for the Elder Ball fight or save it for another day? Uh, we'll see. For now, 150 there. Like, oop. Tipped over a little stack of coins I keep on my desk. Not even a full euro, but still. <laughs> Tuna! Oh, yeah, they mm. added a lot of fish species. Yeah. If you bring them to the cauldron, you dismantle them into fish meat. <laughs> and the bigger the fish, the more fish meat you get. Okay, we're almost to the northern part of the island. But we are definitely not sailing across during the night. Yeah, that... Yeah, I will not... I will be, I will be against that. <laughs> and the wind is against us. I wonder, should we land here? Portal, sleep, and hope we in this weather in the morning. Yeah, we can get we can when we get to the tip of the map again. Is that boat or board that I just clicked away? Now I'll just put down a new one. Okay. Hmm. Uh, let me think, let me think. Yeah, I won't be able to stream for the next few days, but I should be able to stream again on the weekend. I'll just have to double check my schedule. Actually, I, we have plenty of time for that now, until the wind turns. Yeah, so, so I, I do know how sleepy you are after two days of uh, or more of uh, night shifts. Yeah, so probably not. Uh, probably not an e you know, probably not an afternoon stream, but maybe an evening stream. Yeah, maybe. Depends how long you sleep and how you feel. For you can be very wrecked out of those. Yeah. And we already seen that trying to do night shift, then an EV stream on the next day before another night shift doesn't work for you at all. Yeah. Uh, before night shifts, it doesn't work at all. Since I, <laughs> by the time I would be done, I'd already had needed. I would already needed to have left to make it on time. Yeah, or when you, when we like, we did plan to see if we could do afternoon streams on your night shift days, but you kept 
Yeah, you kept sleeping past three and four. Yeah. So, so yeah, yeah. definitely not say, definitely a no for afternoon streams between night shifts. Luckily, it's only two. It should be. The, yeah. the thing with the schedules has changed a bit as they they give out a full month the schedules now, which need to be right, completed a week before the next month starts. So okay, that'll that's give me better. better. Uh, yeah, that that'll give me better uh, a better view of when we can and can't stream. Oh, and we have wind again. Okay, this is a and I'm not, an island. I'm not seeing any signs of land across here. Yeah, it is early morning, and I think you see morning fog. Yeah. Okay, we can keep going till the... Oop, I was looking at the map. <laughs> okay. We can keep going for a bit more till we're at the absolute tip. Okay. Come on forwards. There we go. Oh yeah, let's see, one, two, the third outcropping from here. Oop, I see rocks. <clears throat> we can stop there. Oop. No, it's... Okay, I can't uh, see for safe rock, or certain. More rocks. Oh. And gray lanes. Gray dwarves, but... Yeah, they are the bigger ones. But wind, okay, the wind is in a absolutely horrible position to cross, though, so we'll definitely need to park. There's no way in the yeah, Ten uh, Realms that I'm crossing against wind with no visible land. But, wait, what did you say there? No way in the Ten Realms. <laughs> did you just invent... A new saying, fitting Valheim. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's probably been said before. Uh, first time I hear it. I think someone has said that Valheim is a new 10th realm. Yes, we know way too little about it. We only possibly recently discovered it on a runestone. I think it's specifically called the 10th realm in this game or something at the very start. Yeah, it is. <laughs> But I think, I think Beanie said that he learned that Valheim is a recent discovery as well in, in uh, history. Okay. Uh, let's see. And we didn't, we didn't bring parts for a portal. What? You? And is that a troll? No. Uh, we are reasonably ish nearby. We could we could cross straight ahead to the base. And I still have no sight at all of any land over there. Yeah, and I see but I can team see here. I mean Yeah, let's mine some tin and make a runner. Here. Yeah, for in case in case disaster hits again. that uh, do we break down the boat or leave it here for the moment uh, I say let's leave it here for now do mock it on the map though yeah and let's see this is all shallow enough ish we let me get on. There we go. And just drive this thing completely onto land as much as we can. And I got rid of a threat for it now. Okay, as long as we aren't too near, it should be safe. Yeah, for if we are too far away, no mobs should even be in, spawned in here. Okay, some more tin deposits. 
This might be more than we need, but oh well. You can always make backup I armor. 11. Uh, I think it was more for the nails, but we do need probably for other things. Yeah. But yeah, I've I got, got 11 team now. You got 28, alright. Yep. And we okay. have more than enough. Downing some stew. Refreshing the honey. Yeah, uh, by the way, it says you have. Cook it. Yeah, but uh, it says you'll be having late shifts. I do have an idea. No. Would you dare to do farming between streams? Yeah, I could do some of that, yeah. Also, but we're in the safe area. Yeah, for it might be needed. There we go, that's a lot faster. Yeah, for, I did bring meat and such for health, but we really need uh, good stamina as well for... Health is good! But stamina, you kind of need to do the wool swinging and running. Yeah, it's a balancing act. Yeah, at least, like, if you block now, you do drain some stamina, but you can keep blocking without stamina. In the older combat system, if you don't have enough stamina for block, if this was an issue, you would instantly get staggered. Which then meant you need to eat, you had to decide between hitting or blocking. Yeah, now there's a stagger bar that appears every time you take damage, I think. Yeah, but that it depends on your health. You, like the better health you have, the better block staggering you have. Hello. So there are some people that hate the new food system, but I kind of like it for the it feels more fair for. Yeah, uh, just sure that yeah, got a bit better, but in the past. We, we had trouble fighting Graylings because of the damn stamina kept running out. Yeah. Hmm. It might be best to just do one big health uh, food and then two stamina foods. Uh, at the moment I have 100 maximum-ish. Well, for being more tanky you need two health and one stamina. Yeah. But the two health and one uh, well, one health and two stamina is more of a speedy DPS. But early on, you almost need to be tank. It is only 10% extra movement speed that I got by removing the, my two big pieces of armor, but it feels more like 20%. Well... The more you upgrade your speed, the better it is for... Uh, yeah, once you get up to level 60 or 70 speed running, you won't even need to do that uh, with the armor anymore. Yeah, it's currently at 40-ish. Yeah, 43. Yeah, you're gonna need, to yeah, you're gonna need some more levels on that. Uh, that I noticed. Though I also learned that it is probably good to have the Ecto Blessing. Yeah, and I currently have the Bone Mass one. Uh, we just need to get cr across this, don't we? Yep, and it looks to be going quite a distance. <laughs> Actually... Oh, yeah, even at our place, it's a steep hill. I feel like we built our. We took the camp on the wrong side of this damn thing. <laughs> and we could try to build a bridge at a certain height. Like at this height, it'll be impossible to get it across. But lower down, and there's the catching bin I built. Yeah, you, you might need iron poles, but that's expensive. Yeah. And we need that for other things at the moment. Yeah. So it is a. Still, it's a very distinctive feature of the map at the moment. Uh, this thing again, this shanty, I'll say, I'll call it for the moment. Let's deal with these. There we go, and it's... Okay, that doesn't look like a burial chamber, and that's the timer going off. 
Let's at least get back home. Are you trying to get across? <laughs> yeah, you, you're going up the hill, aren't you? Yes! <laughs> this hill won't stop me! Okay, we'll see who gets there first. Another runestone. Uh, ta -ta -ta -ta. Okay, hearth and home one. Okay, we'll see who gets there first then, because I'm at the shallow end of it now. Yeah, so we should we should make some queen's jam. It's a good all rounder. Yeah, like turnip stew and onion soup is probably better, but probably is, you don't have much of it to begin with. Yeah. Also, also one. Some, we also need to keep in mind that how much something heals because all of these. Yeah, that's the deer stew is three per tick. Still not sure how much of a tick is. Uh, turnip stew is two. Honey is one. Uh, raspberry is one. Sausage is three. Okay. And if I remember correctly, Queen's Jam he is good for healing or something. Yeah, sort of. It's a good early stamina food. Especially yeah. as you get several jaws off it. Yeah, if I recall correctly, it gives 40 health and 40 stamina. Well, yeah, I won big time compared to you. I'm already here and waiting. <laughs> okay, well, I, I at least found more copper. Yeah, we definitely need to make a bigger farm here. Like, yeah, we both probably going to need to plant veggies between the berry bushes and all. Yeah. And... Yeah, do plant them a little bit closer. Would probably be a good idea. Yeah, I could I could dig out a grid or dig out. I could make a grid like uh, previously. Yeah, the grid that almost destroyed them. As it prevented them from growing. Yeah, as long as I didn't put them too close to the edge, though. Yeah, his first grid was an actual grid with tiny squares they planted in it. That didn't work well. Yeah, that wasn't enough space in each square. Yeah. Okay, here we are. Equip up again. And yeah, between, I'll probably... Oop. Oh, there's you. There's a big <laughs> copper deposit somewhere nearby. That one there. I'll probably dig that out uh, off-stream, along with the farming, and from the looks of it, the engines are ready. I will yep. place the iron here for now, so it's going to need to be smelted. Wait, and... did they actually got the iron here now? I just realized that. <laughs> yeah, so just put that put that in the smelter. Uh, put it in the chest next to the smelter, so we can smelt it there. But you can spend the off screen on next time. Okay. Okay, and yeah, make sure up. to replant them as a, so we get more onion seeds. Yep. I won't make uh, that mistake again. Didn't put them all away. And there, that should give plenty. You can actually literally put one more between these. Uh, we don't need that many seeds. Okay. <clears throat> uh, let me just deposit uh, all of this stuff. We're gonna need that. For uh, one seed maker makes three seeds, which means three more onions. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And we need... I mean, we can't cook onions yet. Yeah, but Ed, we so don't we want to, to do have our we don't want to have our storage flooded with them like with the sausages <laughs> that you had. Yeah, do we gonna need a little turnips? Uh, also, off stream, I'll probably just double all of this up. Uh, oh yeah, we only got three turnips left. <laughs> oh, yeah, definitely plant those as well then. Uh, yeah, and plant. Oh no, we have nine just... here. Yeah, I said that nine. Yeah, I, I, I heard that as uh, three. 
Uh, maybe I said free by accident. Oh uh, well. But yeah. Not as Bear. many as possible, for we really gonna need every. as much as possible. Oh, bloody. It's gonna be easier to have a better kitchen in the future, since. Yeah, then we have a house for sleeping and cooking. Not for the factory as well. Also, I got a bit of a dumb idea to maybe put, make some shelves up here and then put the boxes uh, up there uh, in the way that half of it will be on the shelf and the other will be off it, so we can just grab from the underside, sort of. Yo, I don't think that may work, but... Something oh. similar can be done here. Like, we put a wall here. Here under the troll's head. Then we yeah. make shelves. Yeah. Yeah, that will probably be easier. Yeah, since Otherwise, we, I would need to scaffold we, up and break the roof to get into position for that. Yeah, let's see here. Uh, do I even have enough for that? Uh, <laughs> well, that's not a nightmare face at all. <laughs> uh, put the camera in the troll head. Oh dear, yeah, yeah, I saw that earlier. Uh, oops. Okay. Yeah, we can we can also just sort things out a little better then as well. Yeah, just have them sticking out. Then we can have like four of them, maybe six if we move that troll head up. I was thinking more like, uh, let me grab some woods. And there. The face and chest. <laughs> More this way. Uh, that way we can double it up. Oh, that too, but did you see what happened up there? <laughs> yeah, it looks like he's biting into it. <laughs> nom. <laughs> nom nom. Okay. Uh, with that, though, it's time to log off and go raid someone. Yeah, I will log off right away. So let me just record that. And yeah. Exits. Oh dear. I guess we even now able to at least reinforce these base walls against trolls. Yep, that if was need to. I was expecting mm -hmm. the game to jump more to <clears throat> more to the main menu, but oh well. Uh, so yeah, as usual, open up the browser, go to Twitch, unmute it. And then change the screen share there and there. Okay, now let's have a look at who's online. Let's see, we have Kanai who is streaming Enter the Gungeon, Kiri Nuts Yoko who is streaming Monster Hunter Frontier again, Karenai who is streaming again World of Final Fantasy Maxima, Sour, oh, Sour Walrus is again streaming Valheim, and Frayne is streaming Deep Rock Galactic. Good question, who to raid? Yeah, we could go from Valheim to Valheim. Yeah, I guess either so Walrus or K9. Uh, then enter the dungeon. Let's see. Uh, uh, yeah, thing is muted. Uh, let's go do that. Yeah. Uh, Oh, it looks like they're, you know, they're on BRB. I, for a moment, I thought they were going to end. Or, if, well, they're being active. Are they ending their stream or something? Uh, hmm, okay. I can't really say if they're ending or not. Um, hmm. You, you say hey, but... Uh... Uh, I get the feeling they're closing down, so... Okay, <laughs> clips. Let's go raid someone else, then. Refrain is starting up. And Sour Walrus is has been busy for an hour and a half. And, okay, you, they're, they're busy with their monstrosity of a construction again. Yeah, <laughs> yes. What the heck? Like... You want your wooden piece onto a roof, or otherwise it will take rain damage. 
Which means what if something he... hits it, it breaks easier. What even the hell is he doing now? Uh, a part of me wants to go raid them just to see what the ever-loving hell they are up to. Or are they... Okay, I think they're trying to scaffold with all of this stuff. Hmm. I don't even think that. Okay. Uh, Frayne or Walrus, then? Hmm. Good question. Let's go with Frain. Okay. So... For that, construction hurts my eyes. <laughs> yeah, last time we raided, I did say it. I mean, if my friend saw this construction, or quote-unquote construction, did see it. They, <laughs> that he would weep. I okay. did weep. Or we almost weep. I just went, what the heck? Okay, copy-paste. And yeah, let me double check my schedule for when we can stream again. Da, 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 da. Likely not, not this evening and not tomorrow. Yeah, definitely. M maybe, I we say maybe Saturday and Sunday. Uh, hold on a second. What the fuck is with this? If I say maybe Saturday, it would depend. Well, mostly how, uh, well, Kilian gets back to uh, sleep cycle. Yep. The other hell is with this. Uh, what's happening over there? Uh, is, did, did you fill it with a cursed item again? According to this, I should have had a, a night shift yesterday. What the other... Uh, huh? Are they messing up something else with the night shifts and all that? Okay, let me open this up. I'll, I'll check that later. Uh, if I missed another day, that's going to be a bit of an issue. Uh, but yeah, we'll, we'll see when next I can stream. And uh, yeah, that, I, I might be in trouble then. <laughs> oh, uh, yeah, until next time, have a nice day. And until then. Be safe, everyone. And watch out for trolls. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. Oh,